Hi everybody, welcome back. I'm Jennifer and today we are going to have a floss tube video. It is number 87 and I'm going to show you what I've been working on and I'll go from there because it, it's been one of those weeks where you just kind of like, I've been, I haven't been motivated for the past couple of days. I don't know if it's because of the weather or because it snowed here. Um, Monday it snowed its butt off. I mean, we were expecting six inches and when I went to watch the news, um, yeah, we were, we only got, we got nine inches. Yeah. So, mm -hmm. was ex I wasn't expecting nine inches. So the first thing that, um, I wanted to show you is my temperature butterflies. Those of you that uh, don't get to watch my daily videos every morning of what um, the temperature is today. This is where I'm at. This is um, what I've done so far. Today was this where it was, what did I say? Um, I don't even remember what the temperature is today. But this is where I'm at and um, I added the, the word January down below they didn't have it on there but I've had um, it's worded down below and I will do the same thing when I get to February because I got to fix the February butterfly because the February butterfly looks all deformed if you can tell I did this when I was sick and well yeah now I've got to go through here and fix the poor little thing before I could even do February <laughs> so I got plenty of time to go through that and fix that okay um, now big projects um, full coverage I have been working on I worked on uh, Cleopatra uh, Queen of Egypt from Hade last month and this is what she will look like when she's done I am now getting ready to start in this little section right in here and the funny part about this whole thing was when I was looking at my pattern keeper I wasn't really paying attention to the fact that there was another whole row at the bottom that is nothing but I like you know three quarters of a page and when I did this I wasn't even really paying attention so I don't know why I thought that you know the the first whole full page row was all along I, don't ask I don't know I didn't realize it until after the fact and kind of goofed up and I will show you I did goof and y'all are gonna laugh because it was kind of funny because I didn't realize what I did until um it was too late but this is what it looks like I hope y'all can see this I can't tell if y'all can see this but um, that's what it looks like you guys can see I hope you can see this can you see this I hope you said there you go um, if you can see I'll show you her foot now her foot looks a little deformed and it's only because that is um, I don't know why it's different when you're stitching it than what it would look like um, On the, the fabric but I try I did do it the way it said to do it on the pattern and there's her foot I know right it looks totally you know off the wall ridiculously like a deformed foot but that's 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 what it looks like so now I'm over here under I am like right in here under this part so um, that's where I've left off and I will work on that then I will get hopefully have that page done the next time that I work on this and um, which I'm not sure when that'll be because I've been rotating this and I do one project every month and um, I um, am hoping to uh, you know get to that soon I doubt it because next month is my long dog that I will um, start I've started it but I haven't um, been worked on it I need to work on it okay 
next thing is Bountiful Bookshelf from Hay. This is where, this is what I'm doing. Now, I am like right here. I finished this whole part of the, I'm like right in here. And I'm getting ready to start down here and do this part. Um, that's next. And I did a really good job. I was actually shocked at how much I got done. Now, I'm going to tell you, I don't know how much I got done on this. But, because um, I forgot to tally my stitches up. But that's where I'm at. And uh, that's that's where I'm at. And I'm getting ready to start this part. I don't know if I'm going to start it today or um, tonight. I don't know yet. I have work to do. I have to work some this afternoon. So we'll see. I might not get to it until tonight. I don't know yet. So that was all of that. Now the long dog, I did not bring it over here because I haven't started working on it yet. Even though I've worked on it, but I haven't posted any pictures yet of it because um, the sow started the first and I kind of rotate. So what I'm trying to decide what I'm gonna do, how I'm gonna fit that in um, because um, yeah so um, hopefully I can have it you know show it to you guys next week we will see okay um, now challenges and uh, prompts and stuff for groups and events um, I need to complete 10,000 stitches uh, not as soon as possible but one of the um, events that I'm in for magical mysteries I have to do 10,000 stitches for I think it's like a state I can't remember oh my God. I think it's for one of the states but I'm trying to do, what it is they give you um, as a matter of fact hold on I have it here written down uh, da, 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 da. Uh, for Alabama, I need to do 10,000 stitches. And we're kind of going on a, what is it, a stitching retreat, I guess. And not, not retreat. Um, we're touring all the cross-stitch craft stores in each state. So for Alabama, there's five shops and I need 10,000 stitches. And each, um, each state is different. Like for Alaska, there's no, I think, if I'm not mistaken, they said there was no cross stitch shops in um, Alaska. So for that, um, you can stitch 500 stitches to consider moving there to open one up, if that makes any kind of sense. So next month won't be so bad because I can do the 500 stitches in no time flat and we'll get it out of there. So, but each state is different and um, yeah, I have to do a lot of, uh, it's not, I can, do, I can use my project for more than one group and more than one challenge, except for Magical Mysteries because they're not, a, well, no, I'm wrong. It's hard to explain, but anyway, so um I should have been better prepared for that, right? <laughs> um, but, 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 but where is my, where's my list? I have a list. I have a list. I have a list. I have a list. Um, that's, I did that. I started, talked about challenges. Um, I did not count my stitches for this week, um, just because I, <laughs> I forgot to tally them up and, um, um, I've been lazy. I'm sorry, <laughs> but yeah, so, and I showed progress on butterflies uh da, 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 i'm trying to think um also guys those of you that are in my groups you guys um welcome to the sisterhood event has started in cross stitching sisters um 
the rules are in the top. Now, I've had a couple of people ask me in the event, so I'm going to kind of clear it up here so that way you all know what's going on. When you post in the event, you need to post your starting picture, which option you're doing. Now, the options are, option, the first option is, is a get to know you. If you have any sisters, stitch 100 stitches for each sister. So, if you have four sisters, you stitch 400 stitches. Does that make sense? Then for second option, which is a new year, new sisters, stitch on a baby piece, bonus kudos if it's a girl, you stitch a thousand stitches. Okay? Then the third option, if you could be sisters with a literary, literary character, who would it be? Stitch on a piece that fits and why? One thousand stitches. Then the last option, which I chose to do, is stitch on any whip and the goal is 1500 stitches um, now I've had a couple people post and um, or you know comment uh, you know asking me questions and I'm kind of trying to clear it up I'm not trying to sound like I'm a big witch or what have you when you post in the group post what you plan which option you know the first option the second option third option last option and then post your starting picture you can post the starting point picture in the original post then up below after you post it save it there are three dots at the top of where you post it save it hit that those three dots hit save and you can save it then you, that way you won't have to go back and look. You can just click on your saved posts on your Facebook and you can, you know, add to it. Add your progress in the comment section of that original post, including the picture. Because I won't give you credit. No, you're not getting a prize. I was not thinking about prizes. I just you won't get credit. I won't I won't give you credit after the event is over. Um now the next thing um there is a reading and stitching challenge that is pretty simple. Um just if you're reading a book that's 600 pages long then you can stitch 600 pit um 6000 stitches same thing if it's 100 pages you can stitch 1000 stitches um it does not there is no big major rules for that i'm not being um anal about that one um next thing uh full coverage sal 2022 has started you can post progress pictures in the group I do not care or you can make an album um, please make sure that you know you and um, also I have a, a cross stitch zoom every Thursday at 2 p.m. I will put the link in my cross stitch groups I will try to remember to put it in all of my cross stitch groups because I have like four um I will try to remember to do that I remember to do it in a couple and then I forget about the other ones and I totally apologize um also please remember this is a cross stitch zoom if you cross stitch you can come in um if you diamond paint a cross stitch you can come in as long as you cross stitch as long as one of your hobbies is cross stitching I don't care there are an exception to the rule they know who they are okay um also I did want to go over zoom etiquette please guys I've noticed I'm 
I don't like to be a real complete total witch about this, but when you're in a Zoom, especially mine, please be mindful of everybody else. We have problems, um, you know, a couple of times people, um, you know, talking over. Just remember not to do that. Remember to wait until that person is done. Um, I'm not saying it's anybody in special. Um, it's, I, I mean, I've, I'm even guilty of it. So please just remember to, you know, show etiquette and be respectful of everybody else. I'm trying to think what else there is. I keep forgetting. Um, um, I'm trying to think if there's anything else. Oh. Oh, full coverage for Nat, uh, full coverage fanatics. We're doing bike around Germany, and I started it, but I need to update my picture. Um, actually, no, I need to go to the next leg. I completed the first leg, and I need to go to the next leg. And the good thing is, I have it saved on my um, tablet that I you have Pattern Keeper on, and I have that PDF saved, and I can just go in and you know mark it off. So. Um, then, um, there's just a lot of things going on this year. I'm not trying to get involved in too many things this year because, uh, it's just, oh my gosh, you have no idea. It's been crazy. Um, I, um, and not like that with work, it, it's, it doesn't give me uh, as much time to sit and stitch like I did. Now I can, pr I mean, well, no, that's a lie too, because I usually get done work around anywhere between one and five, you know, one to whenever. And, um, some days, you know, it's earlier than others. And like yesterday we, I worked until seven o'clock and, um, I didn't do any stitching. And not only that, it was just one of those blah days where I just didn't feel like doing crap. Believe me. Blah. I didn't even want to do it. I was just like... Mm -mm. So I sat in the recliner and just sat there. <laughs> but, um, and I that, I've... I'm just not motivated. So, we'll see. So, then, um... I'm hoping to get some stitching done today. I'm keeping my fingers crossed. <laughs> well, I guess I could count the temperature butterflies, but that doesn't count because <laughs> it's not a big, you know. But, um, well, I guess it does. So, um, um, yeah, I'm trying to think. There was something else I was going to say and I forgot. <laughs> oh, I did my, re my Goodreads challenge. For this year, I kind of moved it up to 150 books, only because I started doing book reviews last August, I think, and my link to my blog is up on the banner of my channel. My stitching blog is up there, and my reading blog is up there. You guys can go and check it out if you would like. Um, then, um, so I'm kind of, you know, trying to get caught up on that. I may be able to do, you know, update, do a whole bunch of updates on the blog next week. I don't know yet. I'm just trying to get everything, you know, <laughs> caught up. And with this week with little dude in school, he has been totally, um, his routine has just been, because he was off for a whole week and a half, and he's just not wanting to do school. But, you know, what can I say? Gotta do it. So, I've just been trying to get him back into, um, into it and I've been helping him for the last couple of days because uh, a lot of the assignments they I guess the way I'm understanding it from him is a lot of the assignments 
were given to him on the, I think it was the last, what is that? Oh, the last like two days of school and they didn't really give him a due date. And he, um, and of course with him being sick last week, I didn't make him do anything. So we're just kind of, you know, trying to get back into the gist of it. And um, he's not thrilled. So, I mean, yeah, what do you expect? I mean, and of course, with regular school, the schools here at where we live, they're closed due to snow. You guys can't see it, but yeah, it, it just, it's, it's, yeah, there's snow outside. Um, so, and we're supposed to get more. So he's just been kind of like out of it. And, um, He's just not been, he's been disappointed because he can't actually be off. And that's, you know, the worst part. But um, other than that, everything's cool around here. Um, just, you know, what can you do? You can't go, I can't go anywhere. The snow's, you know, out there, but it's, it is what it is. So, that's all I got this week, guys. I hope um, everybody has a great week. And until then, I will see everybody next time. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to hit the like button or the subscribe button. And I will see you all next time.